This video explains how to apply conditional formatting in the list or document library in SharePoint 2013, SharePoint 2016 and Office 365 using List Booster from SharePoint to list. Browse to your list and click on List Booster icon to switch to design mode. This will show List Booster toolbar and put your list in design mode. Now, when you hover over column headers, pen icon shows up. Click it in order to access column settings. In here there are two tabs static and conditional formatting. Let's focus on conditional formatting in this how-to. It works the same way as in Microsoft Excel. You can apply a variety of rules to the selected column. You can work with the text, dates, numbers, including currency, and also numerous ranking options like top, bottom, top percent, bottom percent, and averages. You can select from a variety of colors to set the background and font color, and choose text align and font style for each rule. You can also choose from various indicators and apply any color to it. You also have an option of applying your formatting for the whole row. Let's set a few simple text-based rules. If text contains open, let's set font color to be red, bold it out and select appropriate indicator and its color. Let's add one more rule. If text contains resolved, let's set font color to be green Make it italic and choose indicator with check mark and make it green as well. Click OK to apply it to your list. This feature works well with other features of List Booster like table styles and static formatting. All these styles work equally great in quick edit mode. Column styles are saved automatically. Keep in mind that column styles, as well as any other List Booster styles, are visible to yourself only unless you publish it, which makes it available to other users. Thanks for watching List Booster How-Tos and enjoy your SharePoint with us!